So, um, who's playing the house game? Who wants to play? Oh, one, and two, and three. I do. This is our mono singer. They're going to introduce themselves. We are Shreya Avery Barker, Heidi Carroll, Joe Hogan. Now, give them a round of applause. Thank you. 
never let you retire. Oh God, thank God. <laughs> Talking about retirement, uh -huh. right? Um, well, well. <laughs> some of us, I'm not putting names on any of it, but um, you know, some places where people work, there's like 401k and all those sorts of stuff, right? And I know that there's some people who work here for a long, a, a long time, you know, since before the, you know, the Dodgers moved to LA, LA, right? LA yeah, Los Angeles. Right. <laughs> right. And, you know, and not that, you know, I don't love working here, but eventually I'm going to want to retire. And so, you know, I was thinking well, maybe. Back. I heard it. Ouch. Yeah. Yeah. So I was thinking even before I retire, if, if we could, if, could we get a plan that covers chiropractic care? Is that on the table? You know, yeah. is that. Amanda, I thought, you know, you. Amanda, I thought you would. Okay. Wow. I would love to make a decision to help you out, Dons, but um, obviously Patricia makes the main decisions around here, don't you, Patricia? Oh, thank you, Samantha. I'm glad you recognize, of course. Oh, my God. That was an epic uh, uh, shoot, battle shoot thing when you guys decided who was going to be the main decision. It was. Okay, thanks. Thank you. <laughs> it, was a, it was a hectic nail bite. We but, said before no, 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 no. made the best you can win. Yeah. And she did. She did. She, she did. Yeah. So I want to um, let you know that when you did sign your contract, there was no medical care. And we did not budget it in this year. But I will have Samantha look at the budgets for next year. Thanks. And if we okay. all survive that long. We'll be 71. We'll see. A little older than 71. Well, we're in luck, Patricia. Hey! Yeah. I'm trying to let you know that I consulted the budget last night, actually. Yes. What did it say, Samantha? Mm -hmm. Oh, she's such a smart beauty. It's mess. It's mess. Go mess. Yes. Right. J-E-T. Go mess. Thank you. Anyway. <laughs> What was that last bit? G. Spelling was never my strong suit. <laughs> but I was Sorry, trying to say because I, I consulted our log books and um, I have it here on my phone. And it seems that though we didn't have money for medical expenses, someone expensed 17 Botox sessions. Oh. That's weird. That's weird. Yeah. <laughs> and the most of the like four of us, I think there's only one person who could have done it. God, that's so tough. All right, it was me. <laughs> <laughs> I did it. Okay, I'm not going to die. On, maybe I am going to die on this hill. Okay. You will not die, Dots. Not on my watch. <laughs> Please don't do it here. We can't afford. Let me just ask something else. All right. In other places at work, there's a staff room. We have our meetings on center field. <laughs> 20 minutes before the game starts. Well, don't you love center field? Of course. I spent most of my life here in center field. It just, it, we what? could not maybe do this on the Jumbotron. <laughs> <laughs> it's for transparency's sake. Ah, transparency. <laughs> it's very laughable, isn't it, Lou? <laughs> This notion of transparency from Patricia. <laughs> so funny. What? Are you calling me fat? <laughs> what you can see you right through me, I called you. Why did it have to be so beautiful? <laughs> I would have quit years ago if it was so gorgeous. It's the only thing that keeps me here. I have spent the hot part of my life working at sports. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's not where I want to be. It's not where I thought I'd be in my 50s. Okay. Patricia, just because your hot years were wasted doesn't mean I need to waste my hot years right now. <laughs> You're not in your hot years. <gasps> <gasps> Super soap opera. Lou, Dots. It has been an honor working for all of you. I am done. I quit the center field at City Field. 
You're the scion of the Mets family. Listen to the crowd. You can hear them. Uh,